Hey guys, Vikas over here and today we are going to see how we can backup our Tasmota devices using Node-RED. So I have actually a number of Tasmota devices uh, throughout my home and you know backing them individually is a tedious task. So I thought of using Node-RED and let's see how I'm doing this currently. So what happens is uh, this flow particularly like every 8 hours it just scans through all the IP addresses in my network right so you can see it starts from 1 to 255 okay and it checks for a particular path that is available in task motor devices right cm then question marks cmnd equal to module and basically makes an http request to that endpoint and if it gets the http 200 uh, status code basically it then you know basically as over here it generally checks each IP address individually it joins and finally I'm just storing that to a cache locally that is basically stored into the flow itself so that I can use all the you know IP addresses belonging to test motor devices in later point of time so this happens every eight hours and let's run this flow and we should see all the IP addresses of the test motor devices in my network now over here to backup what I'm doing is every 24 hours I'm just reading the IP addresses of Tats motor devices from the flow right using the same tag over here and then what it does it is basically makes a HTTP request to the particular endpoint which gives the you know configuration backup as dump basically DMP file and is basically a binary output okay so over here i'm checking if i got status code 200 like it was successful or not if yes what it does is basically it writes the binary uh, code basically or binary data into a particular file and over here file name is governed by the ip address and the date okay so here i basically have two sort of backups uh, there is like you know with under folder name zero and one okay so basically it creates under backups dash motor then zero or one based on the day right because i'm doing just modulus and all that then the ip address and with the date like you know the date and month and year all that dot amb so basically it, uh, at any point of time i should have two backups all of all my devices so over here you can see i get all the ip addresses that i ran from this flow and right now i have already i know 16 plus devices in my network then what i can do is i can just click this or inject this particular flow and you should spit out all the backups into this particular directory and over here i have just set up an watcher that will just check you know all the files that's being created in the particular directory and basically whenever there is a new file created or updated it should spit out and we should see the device screen here and you see it has created 16 files for the 16 devices so over here i'm just guessing all the ip addresses you know belonging to trust motor devices because i can use uh, those ad ip addresses in other flows as well okay so that's how i am doing this hope it would help you if so hit the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for videos like this See you next time with our next video. Till then, goodbye.